There you go, man. Thanks, man. So I grew up um, eating native food. I'm Blackfeet from Montana. Mark's mom lived on the Blackfeet Nation, so he grew up eating native food. But when he got older, Mark ran into a problem. You know, we couldn't find it anywhere out here, so we decided to do it ourselves. Enter Off the Res, what Mark calls Seattle's first and only native food truck. We bought the food truck, opened it up uh, in 2011, and we've been going ever since. Yeah. Off the res, meaning off the reservation. So there's kind of like a distinction between natives for on the res versus off the res. And so we're not on the res. <laughs> Mark runs the truck with his partner, Cecilia, who taught me all about what's probably the most important item on the menu, fry bread. So we've had a lot of fun since we've opened, kind of showing people that haven't known what fry bread is. Fry bread is delicate, pillowy, fried goodness. And so usually we, we roll them into little balls and then we stretch them out to order and then toss it in the fryer. Usually just takes a couple minutes per side. They can be served sweet or savory, like when they're the base for their popular Indian tacos. Homemade beef chili. They even do a fry bread burger called a powwow burger, a bacon cheeseburger between two fry breads. So we've got our fry bread buns and then our house-made cumin crema sauce, lettuce and pickled onions. And yes, if you were wondering, they do make a ton of fry bread. A regular day, I would say somewhere around three to 500. Their sweet fry bread is just as popular, whether you get the traditional one drizzled in honey or try one of their seasonal flavors, like their caramel apple with a crumble topping. Their beautiful, colorful food truck travels around Seattle and beyond, serving up native food to newbies and longtime fans. Yeah, I, I really feel good about it. Uh, I have natives from all over the country come up and um, even from Canada, they come down and see us. Off the Res shows that food is much more than food. For Mark, it's a way to honor his family and share his culture, one piece of fry bread at a time.